A judge says a mother who pleaded guilty to stabbing her 10-year-old daughter more than 100 times cannot now change her mind and decide to take back her guilty plea. News on 6's Taylor Newcomb tells us what happened at today's hearing. Tahira Ahmad had several outbursts today inside and outside of the courtroom. The prosecutor says Ahmad's behavior is proof that she was competent enough to know the consequences of her actions. Tahira Ahmad, unhappy after court as the judge rules Ahmad freely and voluntarily pleaded guilty in April. Put that on the nose. This wasn't her first outburst. Ahmad interrupted the judge as she read over transcripts from her plea hearing, accusing the judge of laughing at her and asking her to just get to the point. She acted out in the courtroom. She acted out outside of the courtroom. I think it's clear that um, she's competent and she knows what's going on. The judge read Ahmad's statements from her plea agreement, where she assured the judge she understood her rights to have a jury trial and understood the judge would decide her sentence. Ultimately, the judge denied Ahmad's request to withdraw her plea. I think it was clear to everyone that she was competent when she entered her plea, and I think the judge made the right decision. In this case, I don't think that she was capable of entering a knowing and intelligent plea of guilty. I think she was in the grips of a profound mental illness, and I think the court was wrong today. Ahmad told her mom she loved her before she was escorted out of the courtroom in handcuffs. She'll be back on the road to prison immediately. The judge sentenced Ahmad to life in prison plus 10 years. That means Ahmad will be about 87 years old before she'll even be eligible for parole. In Tulsa, Taylor Newcomb, Oklahoma Zone, News on 6.